First images after eruption of the Shivelich volcano are now available. My colleagues in the Russian Academy of Sciences have uh, uh, provided these images. As you can see, uh, the satellite image shows the dispersion of the ash cloud into the Aleutian Islands. And this is the image of my geologist colleague who actually were trapped in the, uh, in the, the ash storm. As you can see, they were actually working to see what happened to this forest with the ash flow it completely flattened something like a Tunguska or St. Helens and then this happened they get trapped but they were clever enough actually uh, to up turn their scooters upside down and just take a shelter under it until they get, get a little bit better so they can move back to their bases unfortunately the bases and the homes uh, the situation was not much better uh, this is the communities in that area which are now suffering from the lack of sunlight and being covered by the ash cloud. Now we have the satellite images of the f uh, first satellite images of the Shivalaj volcano after the eruption. So I'll try to compare it with what is now available with what we had in the past. So these two images to the right shows what it is now and the, to the left shows what it was in the past. I've marked uh, similar landmarks on here and we go to find which actually went is erupting now. And when we mark this uh, uh, familiar features, we come to the conclusion this uh, vertical wall toward the right uh, in that uh, rectangle is the one that we see in the, ref, um, in the left image, the past image. And when we mark also the landmarks there with the green arrow, we come to, to the conclusion that the erupting went is this one i have written to the left in the left image is this and that is the um, um easternmost uh, went erupting and actually despite what we thought that we may have a collapse of the mountain so far what we can say is that is a vent eruption not a collapse of the flank of the volcano although we have to wait and see for better images this is what i can say for now